we have to find the value of this 4 by 4 determinant for this we have to expand this with one any one row or any one column of this determinant for this we use the first row here and the first element is 5 so write 5 there now for the sign convention here the sign convention is like plus minus plus minus minus plus minus plus then again plus minus plus minus minus plus minus plus for the sign convention you must remember the rule that is minus 1 to the power i plus j here i is the number of row and j is the number of column so for this element 3 the number of row is 2 so i is 2 there and number of column is also 2 so it will be minus 1 to the power 2 plus 2 so minus 1 to the power 4 so that is plus 1 so the sign is plus and for this element 1 the number of row is 2 but number of column is 1 so minus 1 to the power 2 plus 1 that is minus 1 to the power 3 that is equal to minus 1 so the sign is minus thus we can get all the sign of every element now for the 5 give the determinant by cancelling the plus 5 cancel the row and column consisting the element 5 and write the remaining determinant so the remaining determinant is 3 2 1 0 3 0 and 2 3 4 for this just cancel the row and column of the element now for 0 that is the sign of minus so minus 0 in the determinant cancel the row this row and this column and this row ok and write the remaining elements that is 1 2 1 2 0 3 0 1 3 4 now for this 2 the sign is plus there so this will be plus 2 and the determinant cancelling the row and column that is 1 this 1 3 1 2 0 0 1 2 4 now for this 0 that is minus 0 write the determinant cancelling this row this column it will be 1 3 2 this determinant 3 2 2 0 3 and 1 2 3 now this is equal to 5 into we can easily find the value of this 3 by 3 determinant it is very easy so the value would be 30 now this is the 30 uh, this value is 0 and for this that is plus 2 into the value of the determinant is would be minus 20 sorry that is 30 you said write the wrong ok 5 into 30 plus 2 into minus 20 minus it will be 0 so cancelled out now that is 150 minus 40 so it will be 110 thus we get the value of this determinant using this method now we see, show you that we get the same answer if you expand it with another row or another column now we expand it with this column and we show that the answer will be same 110 so first term is 0 so write 0 there and expand it with this column and the remaining determinant is like this cancelling the row and column existing the element 0 
it will be one three two two zero three one two three now with respect now you can see that is plus one now we forget to give the sign of the zero so that is minus so give this minus now with respect to this one cancel for this plus one and the determinant will be cancelling the column and this row we get the remaining determinant there that is five zero two two zero three one two three now with respect to this zero that is minus sign so minus zero we cancel this row and this column and we get that remain determinant that is five zero two five zero two first row then one three two one two three now with the last element that is four that is plus four for the sign so plus four into the determinant cancelling the row and column existing four that is this row and this column cancelled out and this remaining determinant five zero two one three two one two three and that is five zero two one three two two zero three okay now we have to get the value of this 3 by 3 determinant of all now for first term will be 0 because this multiplied to it 0 for the second term that is 1 into the value of this determinant can be easily found because it's a 3 by 3 mat determinant so it will be minus 22 you can easily find out it and the next term will be 0 and for this the value of this determinant if we calculate will be 33 so it will be minus 22 plus 132 that is equal to 110 thus we get the value same with the previous that is the value of this 4 by 4 determinant <coughs> so we can see that we get the same value if we expand the determinant with any row or any column so thus we can get the value of any 4 by 4 determinant